What's up guys, Viral Zen back again, showing you guys how to dodge bouncing bays and claim wars with the help of my friend Viral Shuffle. And there you go, you pretty much just lay the fuck down. And that works for bouncing bays at least. Most people already knew this, but just in case someone did not know, that's just videos for you. So obviously not for people who know what they're doing. So that's from my point of view. Just lay down and you're all good. So now this is what happens if like say it's your Betty. They come in, they lay down, you're not laying down, you die, and that's how that works. And um, we tested it. There's a whole second before it goes off. And if you lay down for anything between like 0.5, so like a half a second below, you don't take any damage. But if you wait till around 0.7, you get hurt a little bit. But other than that, anyone with even a slow reaction time should be able to, as soon as they hear the little click, start laying down and survive. Um... We tested to see if just crouching would work, so we thought maybe you would just get hurt or something, so we decided we'd test that out, and this is the result. Crouch, you still die. You have to crouch, and you have to go prone eventually, so playing tactical plays pays off because you get to dodge even quicker besides having to press B, and this is our Claymore test. And then there's a bunch of ways. You can probably just run through it sometimes in some, some, situations, some situations, but um, I found that if you're like if you're running and you jump, you pretty much have no chance of dying. You normally don't get hurt. But some, like right there, he got hurt, but oh well. And like, see, if you're running and you jump, you have a much better chance of surviving than if you don't jump at all. Because right there, I probably would have died if I didn't jump. But jumped, got to live. So now we're waiting for him to respawn. We're going to have him try it out too. His is angle more straight. I'm going to turn mine more to the side, see if that's anything to do with it. So we wait for him to go through the door so I don't kill him with the claymore. Mine's a little more angled outward, so it has a little bit wider blast radius. See if that changes anything. See if it gets a kill. Um, waiting on him, waiting on him, and he comes through, and he gets hurt, but he survives. So, thank you, Viral Shuffle, for helping me out. Um, playing on his other account, Carnivorous, though, so that's why I didn't say Viral Shuffle. Uh, thanks a lot for watching. Hope this helped out the few people who didn't know this. If you already knew this and you watched it, thanks for watching anyways. Alright, peace out. See you.